In this problem, we have two point charges, Q sub 1 equals 26 uh, microcoulombs, and Q sub 2 equals negative 47 microcoulombs. We are asked to find the distance between the two points if the electrostatic force between them has a magnitude of 5.7 newtons. First of all, turning to Coulomb's law, which is the formula for electrostatic force, we can see that the charges are written in absolute values, so the negative sign on the 47 microcoulombs can be ignored. Also worth noting is the fact that we'll want to be using SI units as usual, so let's convert microcoulombs to coulombs by using the definition of the micro prefix indicated by the, the mu symbol. So we'll multiply the charges by 10 to the power of a negative 6. Now it's time to find the distance. In our Coulomb's Law formula, we have all the values except for the distance between the points, or the r here in the bottom, and it's what we want to find. So let's rewrite the formula to isolate r. First, let's multiply both sides of the formula by r squared, and then divide both sides of the formula by f to get r squared on its own. And then we'll take the square root of both sides to change r squared into just r. And now our formula says that r, or the distance between the points, is equal to the square root of k times the charges over the force. All that's left to do is to substitute our values in. And this right here is what our formula looks like. And of course, uh, for the k constant, the Coulomb's constant k, I'm plugging in 8.99 times 10 to the 9th power of the newton meters squared per Coulomb squared. Uh, pardon the slightly messy mouse handwriting, but if you're following along, then it should be pretty clear what I'm writing. And plugging this into our calculator, we find that the distance is equal to 1.39 meters. And that is the distance between the two point charges.